Hi everyone, it's Maggie, and I wanted to share uh, some surprise happy mail that I received from Loretta, who is the Carton Barn here on YouTube, and she sent me a beautiful little birthday box. This is, I think, the third time I'm doing this video. Um, the first time the cat jumped and knocked the um, camera off, and... The second time, uh, my son came down and walked in without realizing I was making a video. So, hopefully three times <laughs> is a charm. But anyway, she sent me this beautiful vintage birthday card with a little note inside. Thank you so much, Loretta. Loretta won um, one of the prizes in my last giveaway. And... She made me some beautiful flowers. Let me just get them together. And then I'll show you one at a time. She made me this beautiful one here. And this is a perfect size for a doily album. And then she made me a ribbon one, which I've never seen before. This is my first ribbon flower. And she made it in my favorite colors. It's gorgeous. I love that. And then she made me this one here out of a, um, it's like a st stretchy trim. And I love this trim. I love how it has the edging on it. And she did a running stitch. And it came out beautifully. Oh, I love that. I will definitely have to use that on a project too. And then she made me this beautiful Kenzashi flower. Let me just kind of get um, squished in the box. But look at how beautiful that is. Oh my gosh, and I love the colors. And look at that pearl and bling center in the middle. Thank you so much, Loretta. I wish you did videos. You should do videos of your work. And then she sent me some uh, bridal trim, which I believe would be probably a hem, a piece of a hem. It's gorgeous. And she sent me some a couple of napkins. Look at how beautiful. Of flowers and this one. Aren't those beautiful? I'll have to do a mixed media project with that. And then she sent me some um, vintage trims. She sent me this fringe trim here. A small fringe. Love that. And then this beautiful vintage lace here. And then this beautiful vintage lace here. This might even be a ribbon trim. And you can put um, ribbon in between also. It's on the stiff side, so I think it might have been like a, a trim for like a bow or something. But look at how beautiful that is. And then she sent me this little crochet trim. Love these for putting around um, images using to frame them. And then she sent me a couple of um, Battenberg doilies in different, well, I guess maybe it is the same shape, just one smaller than the other. Can't wait to use those. I can always use those for my minis. And then this beautiful heart-shaped uh, doily piece here. Look how beautiful. And then she sent some Michael's frames. You can always use these for boxes, altered boxes. And she sent me two more trims. This one here. Look at how beautiful. And you can cut these to make individual dangles. This is beautiful too. Can't wait to use that. And 
and this beautiful ribbon and pearl trim. I haven't seen this one before, but look at how gorgeous that is. <coughs> Excuse me. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my gosh, I love this. This will go on something really special. And then she sent me a little pouch of goodies. There's this bracelet. And here's an earring. Love using these on projects. Here is another earring. And look at this piece. How beautiful is that? <coughs> Excuse me. I'm so sorry. And then this piece here. And there's acrylic roses in between the stones on this one. In my favorite color. And a couple of buttons. And then she sent these three rhinestone pieces. Those are beautiful. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> excuse me. Oh, so sorry. And I'm almost done, so I'm not going to do this video again. Oh my goodness, my allergies are to the point where I'm afraid to do videos anymore. Look at this piece here. That's beautiful. <clears throat> and this beautiful piece here. And then look at those these two tiny, tiny little cameos. I have never seen them that tiny. Those are amazing. Thank you so much. Loretta. <clears throat> and then the last thing she sent was a tassel to alter. And I can't wait to do that. I've never done an altered tassel, but she also made me one. <clears throat> Excuse me. Look at this. Look at how gorgeous. All flowers, all different color purples my favorite and look at these did you make these you've got to tell me Loretta if you made these oh my gosh it's beautiful and then look at the beads that she put all around the tassel oh I hope you can see this all the work that went into it this is absolutely gorgeous Loretta and I love it and I can't wait to hang it up Oh, and I just, this tassel is so soft, and I love how it's, um, it's like when somebody braids their hair and then takes it out. I love that. I haven't seen that. Oh, my gosh. Thank you so much, Loretta. This was so amazing, and I just love everything you sent me, and I'll use it all. And um, <clears throat> more importantly, I so appreciate your friendship and all the comments you always leave on all my videos. You are just a sweetheart. So thanks again and thanks for watching everyone. And if you'd like, leave me a comment and I will see you again soon. Bye for now.